last home game. Pretty cool way to go out, isn't it? Yeah, <laughs> I couldn't imagine it any better than it than it was because it's kind of was just the whole game. You know, it, it wasn't going how I wanted it to at first. So I think it's very like uh, reminiscent of my career. You know, you kind of just gotta just keep going, keep going, and if soon enough it'll pop. You know, and that's just the game of football for me. You scored six touchdowns last year. You have one each in the last two games, but didn't have any before that this year. Um, resiliency again for you. I mean, it's been your whole career, like you said. Was it a matter of just telling yourself to stick with it, and results will come? Yeah, absolutely. Because I was finding myself just trying to calm myself down. Because like, you can kind of press and force things, but you know, you got to let the game come to you. You know, I was just telling myself, just stay patient, stay patient. Because you know, I wasn't having bad runs, it's just things just wasn't get going the way I wanted it to yet at the time. So I just had to stay patient and, and let it come to me. What were the emotions of senior day like for you? And it was great, like from start to finish, you know, to see my parents, you know, it always just put something on my heart, you know, just to see my parents and my little brother, like, and they're just so proud, you know, and that's just something that I've always strived to do is just to make my parents proud. and. You know, for it to finish the way it did, it was just, it was a story book ended for me. How gratifying is this for the team to be playing so well down the stretch and now you have a chance to finish your senior year in a three game winning streak? Uh, it's very gratifying because along the way you can have like some thoughts and just be like, man, like what, what is it? What is, what are we not doing? But you know, that we never let that stop us from preparing the way we prepare. And um, you know, it just kind of just led into those wins, you know, you just keep on going, keep on going, and then soon enough it'll, it'll pay off. So that was the main outlook of that. Coach talked about Liberty being a good run-stopping team. Uh, do you recall that from the first meeting, and what have you seen on film maybe since you played them last? Um, yeah, they are pretty uh, – they're a good run-stopping team. You know, they play as well. You know, they always have somebody for the quarterback. They always have somebody for the running back. Um, and they do a good job at it. You know, they got people that get off the ball in the D line and, you know, linebackers that'll fit gaps in a hurry. So, um, you know, it'll it'll definitely be a challenge because, you know, they're familiar with us and we're familiar with them. And, you know, it's just gonna be a matter of executing. It's supposed to be cold, raining in Lynchburg Saturday. Does that change what you do at all? And does that make anything tougher for you as a running back? Mm. Not so much, you know, you kind of just emphasize ball security and, and wet games like that. Um, um, you kind of adjust your attire, of course, you know, so you can be prepared. And, but overall, the game is, will still be the game, you know, and I'll be re ready for whatever adjustments we need to do. Getting Sage back in the offensive line, the healthiest it's been, how has that helped you and Jason in the running game? Man, it's helped us tremendously. You know, those guys are very, um, like Sage, he's a guy that's, you know, a true talent that you don't really find anywhere. And he, he pretty much just transformed our offense, you know, like we just look better on the, as an offense with him on the field. And on that last run, you know, you, you could see him on film driving the guy all the way off the of film. So like, you know, as much as I want to credit myself, you know, I got to give credit to the offensive line for blocking for me the way they do. Jason McKen, and Christian. Um, along those same lines, Christian, like Trujillo next to Sage, like has that been, how has that helped, especially within the run game? It seems like that's that's more of his natural position. Um, has that been key the last couple of weeks to having him inside with Sage outside? Yeah, um, Trujillo is back to his, uh, his natural habitat. He's more of an interior lineman. He's played center, he's played guard. Um, Sage, he's a true tackle out there. So just getting those guys back to where they're, to where they're home helps out a lot. And, and um, it also gives an uplift to the rest of the guys like Max Woolheit, um, Tony Bello, and uh, Jalen Guerrero, those guys, you know, and it's a full unit now. So uh, well, it's close to a full unit as we're gonna get at this point. So um, it just gives everybody a, a sense of confidence and, a, and an uplifted uh, spirit. Um, you've, uh, you were talking about maybe the numbers haven't been what you wanted, but like I think you've been a really like an important player the last couple of years for the team. So, like, what's it been like though the last couple of weeks seeing you know your teammate Huntley just go nuts uh, rushing the football? Hmm. Man, it's 
awesome. You know, I love to see my guys having success. You know, uh, and it's just it's just great. You know, like I like to see the I like to see him doing good and because you know we're from the same city, as, uh, of course. So like that that also is a good thing to see somebody from where you're from doing well. Um, and also as a unit, you know, as a running back room, it just shows how dynamic and how talented we are um, as a group. Christian, last year, last year you guys went out there and it was uh, it was a rainy and cold game and turned out to be really low scoring and all that. The, the way you guys have been running the ball the last couple of weeks, how much better prepared for a, for a bad weather game do you think you guys are? I feel like we're, we're capable of getting it done in the rain. Um, if we have to lean on the run game, I feel like we're, we're good enough to get it done. Thank you.